you can see, I just went to Whole Foods in Trader Joe's and I'm just gonna do a little grocery haul. So obviously you can see that I got watermelon LaCroix and some tangerine LaCroix. In this first bag, I just got strawberries and blueberries. I got carrots for juicing and a cucumber. And I also just got their homemade guacamole and salsa. Okay, in this bag, I got bananas. I got some Lara bars because they were on sale. They were like a dollar each. So I got a blueberry muffin one, coconut cream pie, chocolate chip cookie dough, and an apple pie. And then I also just got the Valentine's Day RX bar because it's chocolate raspberry and it just sounded really good. Okay, I also got some oranges for juicing and some lemons. And then I just got some canned chickpeas because at some point I want to try to make some roasted chickpeas. I got this Oatly oat milk and then I got some Oatly ice cream and I've tried this before and it's so good. But I also think it's just really cute because it matches the milk. But yeah, I've tried this before and it's so good. So if you want a dairy free option, I recommend the Oatly. And then I just got some frozen strawberries and mangoes for smoothies. And then I already opened them, but I got some tortilla chips just to go with my guac and salsa. Okay, and now from Trader Joe's, the first thing, Obviously, I got some flowers. I just got some white roses. I just thought these were so pretty right when I walked in, so I got these. And then I just picked up some raw almonds because I wanna try to make my own almond milk because I found out you can make almond milk in a juicer, which I never do that. So yeah, I'm just gonna try to make some homemade almond milk. I got some coconut flakes just for like my oatmeal or smoothies. And lastly, this is like my new favorite snack. It's dried mangoes. I picked up two because this is just something I like to eat on my snack or lunch break. And then I decided to show these as well. These are not for me. These are for my dogs for Valentine's Day. I just got a pink one for my girl dog and a blue one for my boy dog. For Ringo and Maggie and I just think these are so cute. I got them this brand for Christmas. There was like a Christmas version of these and they loved them. So I had to pick them up the Valentine's Day ones. I forgot a few things because they were in the fridge. Um, I just got this original hummus. And then I picked up these three soups because it was buy to get one free. I got vegetable soup, minestrone soup, and Nana's chicken noodle soup. I thought these would be good for this week because it's supposed to be snowing a lot the next month. So these are just good like on a snow day. Okay, so that was everything I got for this week's grocery trip. And now I'm just gonna move on and show you my fridge organization and like a little fridge tour. Okay, so like I said, now is my favorite time of the week is when I get to clean out and organize my fridge. This is kind of embarrassing to show, but this is what it looks like right now. All right, so now I'm just gonna take everything out, wipe it down with bleach, and then I'll show you the after. Okay, everything is on the counter. This is what the fridge looks like. As you can see, it really needs to be cleaned. So now I'm just gonna wipe it down. Okay, so I wiped out the fridge. It's looking so good. I've been letting it air dry for a little bit. And now that it's all dry, I'm just gonna start putting everything back in the fridge. Okay, so I washed the blueberries and strawberries and I put them in this container. I cut the stems off the strawberries. I just like to do this because it makes it a lot easier to snack on these and they're already washed so I can just go in, grab them and eat them. So yeah, this just makes it a lot more convenient. And if anybody cares, I got this at Home Goods. Okay, so here is the after. Up top, I just have some drinks like Celsius, LaCroix. I have my strawberries and blueberries that I just washed. I usually have a lot more vegetables in here, but it's almost a weekend and I'm going home this weekend. So I try not to stock up too much on things that could go bad. So I usually just have peppers and different vegetables in here. I always have lemons and limes in this one. This is my asparagus holder. I didn't get any asparagus this week, but I usually have asparagus in there. Then we just have some eggs. 
And down here I usually just have all the leftovers or the HelloFresh meals for that week. But right now I just have my carrots and the three soups I got in the grocery haul. And here I just keep cheese. We just have some Mexican cheese, Parmesan, um, and some cheese wedges. And then I just have some mini chocolate chips in case I wanted to make cookies or something. Down here I just keep oranges and onions. I go through onions like crazy. So I started buying them in like the onion bags. And then I just have my oranges for juicing. Over here I just have some dips like hummus, guacamole, salsa, and then I have these pickles which are the best pickles in the world. Um, some butter, some try to concentrate my oat milk. And down here I just have all the basics like maple syrup, soy sauce, mayonnaise, ketchup, pickles, garlic, apple cider vinegar. And down here I keep a baking soda because I've watched a lot of fridge tours and everyone had one of these. So I added one to my fridge. I guess it helps with the odor. And then I have some wines. So yeah, this is what the fridge looks like for this week. And like I said, it's different every week. Right now this is pretty bare for me. I usually have this section all filled up with HelloFresh meals or leftovers, but like I said, it is Friday, so I didn't want to stock up for the weekend when I'm not going to be here. 